I'm here in the pastor's study. Not the office, but the study. Uh, I'm not going to show you around. It's full of junk. I need to clean it out. Um, and I'm grateful to have it. It's neat to have a spot. Um, I showed you earlier in a, in a Vesper the, uh, the whole book in a picture. Uh, the book of Proverbs. Uh, my mother-in-law, the late Phyllis Mignatis, gave it to me. I think there's also the sonnets of Shakespeare, that kind of thing. But check this out. She also gave me this. Look at this. It's called Adjectives um, Have Three Degrees of Comparison. Short, Shorter, Shortest. Mary, James, and Frank. Um, the positive degree is just one short. The comparative degree, comparing two things, shorter. And the superlative degree, uh, three or more. Uh, my daughter Christine loves to say the expression, good, better, best. Never let it rest until your good is better than until your better is best. Uh, the 16th chapter of the book of Proverbs uses the word better at least four times. So kind of keep your eye peeled. Uh, if you're comparing two things, it's going to be the comparative degree. And the word, the proper word to use is better. Uh, and the book of Proverbs has a lot to say about certain things that are better than others. For example, uh, a good name or a good reputation, we'll talk about that later, um, the God willing, is better than uh, great riches. Uh, wisdom is greater than gold. Um, a lot of different things, one thing better than another. Um, life is full of choices, and we choose multiple times on a daily basis. If it's two things, one thing or the other, as Jesus said, no one can serve both God and money. No one can have two servants. He'll hate the one and love the other, love the one and hate the other. No one can serve God and mammon, God and stuff, God and money. Um, choose God. Uh, the Apostle Paul in 1 Timothy chapter 6 tells us that godliness with contentment is great gain. You know, it's the 10th commandment, thou shalt not covet. So it's a better choice to choose contentment over covetousness. And here in the book of Proverbs, some things are better than others. If you're comparing two things, it's the comparative degree one thing is better than the other. It's kind of upside down to the world in which we live. Um, that a good reputation um, is better than great riches. Uh, that wisdom uh, is better than gold. And it goes on and explains several other comparisons from that point forward. But just uh, let me encourage you. The point of the Vesper today is this. When considering to choose the better not according to the world or your own insight, but according to the Word of God. Thanks for tuning in today. Remember, like my daughter likes to say, good, better, best, never let it rest till your good is better and until your better is best. But when choosing two things, choose the better. God bless you. Have a good evening.